you know, some of the fans have been writing in, they said, uh, you know, you gave us a peek inside the old vault, but uh, what else you got in there? So let's take a, you know, real quick, we'll take a look, then we'll do some guitar. Hang on. Yeah, we got dead stuff. First album, insert to the first album, first live album. What's this? Pig Pen, dead at 27, April 12, 73, Rolling Stone. You saw this one already, but I used to make set lists. Springfield, Mass., March 28, 73. 30 tunes. 30 tunes. Dark Star. Best Dark Star ever, according to me. I don't know how I would know that, but that's what I said. Five stars. Dark Star. Round and round. Five stars. Night's best. I have to check this out. Springfield, March 28, 73. Got to go back and review that show. Wow, here's Watkins Glen, and here, here's those pictures I took. There's Bob and Donna. What we got here? There's Bob. Man, I was close. Bob. More Bob. Wow. And there's the poster. That's what became the poster. There's the Jerry with the strap, the alligator strap. Wow. Last one alive. Watkins. Where are we here? Syracuse. Buffalo. Looks like Roosevelt. Something memorial. Roosevelt. Roosevelt. Maybe that's a September show. What else? Oh, yeah. Yep, here's the proof. Here's the book. There it is. What's this? Nassau. More picks. Philly Civic Center, 74 August. Here's a Roosevelt show that got rained out. Rained out, and they played it on August 6th, for real. Rained out show. Boston. Jerry, there's the alligator. You can see it clear as a bell, right there. Look at this. That's an ad from Rolling Stone for Wake of the Flood. November 73. So there you go. I mean, uh, on the subject of YouTube, uh, I'm sure it has not escaped your notice that uh, in one month we got 75 people who want to do one thing. And that's talk about play some Grateful Dead. And of all the uh, myriad human endeavors that there are, I mean, we're like uh, one-tenth of one-tenth of one percent of what's going on in the world, you know. <laughs> but here you are. Now, uh, multiply that by all the people on earth and all the things that people are interested in doing. And uh, I don't know about you, but I see some potential here. I see some opportunities. And uh, I have no doubt that uh, has some reason uh, why somebody would pay $1.6 billion for this thing, because it's only going to get better. It's not going to get worse. It's going to get better. And uh, you want to be out there, and you want to be happening with it. That's my attitude anyway. So anyway, I'm looking at some other dead tab sites, and I found some pretty good stuff. Now, for example, I play Althea like this. <laughs> But the real way you play it is finger pick. That's how Jerry did it. But uh, since I've never been a finger picker, I had to uh, improvise, you know. But there's a guy on the web. He's shown me something I never could figure out. You know, and just to kind of make my point about uh, trading off with people and improving, I'm going to add one note, basically an alternating bass to make it even sound to my ear even a little bit better. It's tough to play, it's a little tricky with a flat pick, but uh, here goes. <laughs> 
Thanks for the help. Appreciate it. 